Fuck! Anakin, okay. <laughs> this might be a little harder with the same colors here. Okay, we'll start off with Ken, and I'll do some brief kind of introductions. Uh, yes. Ken, generally considered not as good as Ryu, even though he's a Shoto, he has a lot of the same moves. Um, he just doesn't have... Like, his super is really only good in combos. Kind of anti-air, but not really. Like, his regular uppercut does probably either the same or more damage. More, I guess. But he has a lot of the same moves on the surface, but actually, if you get kind of deeper into his playstyle... Oh, I fucked it up. Mother Beecher! If you get deeper in his play style, dare you? Um, Ken's much more mix-up heavy. He has a good footsies tool, um, but he has a worse fireball. That makes it harder. harder. Better uppercut, though, so... That's how it goes. Now, we'll cover some basic normal stuff as usual. Yes. Kind of go deeper. Priorities go and yeah. stuff. Zoning and spacing and all, all these that juicy stuff. stuff that all the Street Fighter guys, guys you guys are used to seeing. Uh, Ken's stand jab. Generally not very good. Kind of good as like a safe anti-air in certain matchups, like against Honda. Kind of quick, not easy to punish unless they aim high, but it's there for to be there. Uh, stand medium punch. Actually, kind of a better anti-air. Does more damage, has good priority. As you can see, the, the hurt box is pretty much or non-existent. Like right here. I can mash it all day long, they'll just go right through each other for, for the most part. Unless he walks into it, which he did a few times. So really good. Uh, stand fears, not all that useful. It, it does the same thing as Stan Strong, but slaggier. Has worse priority. Does more damage, but... Major yeah, bullshit. Not, not, not a big deal, really. W uh, in what situation would you want to use the, uh, the standing uh, fierce? Never. <laughs> to be honest, like, it's really... It's something you can completely ignore and not use, and you'll be fine. But Stan Jab, Stan Strong, they kind of had to use his anti-airs, but that's really situational. Uh, Stan Light Kick. Looks kind of cool. Looks like it hit low post, but it really doesn't. Um, it's really kind of a cool s safe media, though. And it hits low, which is kind of important. It's mostly used for in combos, but in a neutral game, it's not really that big of a deal. Oh, I forgot to set up training mode. Oh, yeah. We, oh, yeah, training mode. Yes. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. N now, next week. Yeah, no. Remind me. Now, stay on medium kick actually is a good anti-air. It looks like a good anti-air. hits above his head. has decent priority. Decent damage. It's a good anti-air if you can't uppercut reliably, but... Definitely the uppercut it should be your number one anti-air. Uh, Stan Roundhouse is the one big difference between him and Ryu. As you can see, kind of leans forward a little bit, moves him forward. Kind of heavy startup, but has good range, does good damage. It's really nice. Yeah, it's a good poke tool. It's nice. So you can do things like if you're trying to play footsies with someone, you can fake low. And he's pretty punish. quick for a, you know, for a fierce. I mean, he's laggy. It'll get counter poked a lot, but I mean, it does such good damage. Even if it trades, it usually wins out for you. You can punish as usual. But that's a lot of very common Ken subs in the footsies game. You kind of dance around, crouching short, bait something, and then just roundhouse, and you kind of step in. You mother <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, God. I will challenge you. <laughs> oh, Evan, don't you worry. I'm getting ready to do some masculine combos. Don't you worry. I've, I've been practicing lately, so I'll be, I'll be good. Combos are for losers, please. Uh, but yes, Nabil Robinson in chat makes a good point. There's a very good player called Metsun, who's a Japanese player. Uh, runs one of the uh, game centers in Japan, which I will meet this year when I go to Japan. So Metsun runs the uh, <laughs> game center? I don't know if he runs it, but he works there as, a, I guess, one of the whatever managers or worker. Okay. Um, very good Ken player. Has played Ken literally for the past 20 years in every version of Street Fighter. That's just his main character. Has very, very, uh, very nice uh, way of dressing. Oh, yeah. He looks like a, like a J-pop rock. He has, like, rhinestone jeans and He looks like, like J-pop uh, oh, Ken doll. Yeah. You know? Oh, yeah. Um, Look at your styling with your bullshit three-hit super combo fiend <laughs> bullshit 34,000 <laughs> points. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Okay. Those are standing pokes. We'll do low pokes. Crouch jab, useless. Crouch medium punch. Uh, kind of a safe medi. So if I like, if I knock you down and yeah. I walk up and I go like that, it's kind of hard to reversal. S st same with a crouching jab. A little risky against Ken because the uppercut might catch you, but for the most part, it's a kind of similar to stand strong. There's no hurt box behind it, so it's kind of a safe, quick meaty. Counter poke certain at high attacks. Not terribly useful. Let's see. Crouching Fierce. Good anti-air. Kind of slow as shit, but... Very slow I mean, it's shit. called the Mexican uppercut for a reason. If you can't uppercut and they jump, just do Crouch Fierce. It hits them. It might trade, but whatever. It's a, you know, it's a, it's a good anti-air. You, uh, you're supposed to do the, the thing when I jump in. 
Oh, sorry, sorry, I forgot. It's been on, a I haven't done this tutorial. Come, Come on, man. In a while. You are so. professional. You are El Presidente. <laughs> you are wearing uh, the golden hair. Well, you know, I'm the playing a white face. Uh, you do look like I white, dude. Taco McD. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, GMC01 has a good idea. Good frame advance at Crowd Strong. So if I, if I like, knock you down, yes. and I walk up, I can do Crowd Strong, I can sweep into it, I can combo into it, I can do Crowd Strong, walk up throw. Sorry. But you have to zone properly, of course. Well, it's like, a, it's like a pressure tool. Like, it changes the timing of certain... By the way, Taco MD is Dr. Taco. Just letting you know. You have to refer okay. to him as Dr. Taco. Taco MD? I don't no, know. Taco his MD. name is Dr. Taco. Please. Respect Ever. the Taco. Okay, anyways. Uh, okay. Crouching pokes. Crouching short. Doesn't have fantastic priority, but it has kind of good distance. Good distancing. Can be used in mix-up. You can go crouch short, walk up throw. Stuff like that. It's, it's a good it, mix-up It has good... Uh, how is how is the hurt box range? It's okay. I mean, it looks like uh, as far as it is a scratch beating oh. kick, but yeah. But crouch short is good. Counter pokes are in low attacks. Uh, mostly used for mix ups. So if you're close to someone, you can do crouch short throw, crouch short uppercut, crouch short super. You God lost me at crouch. Kind of that stuff, which, which combos if I do it right. That's crouching short, cross medium, pretty much the same as Ryu's. Good poke, kind of fast, has good range. It's shorter than the actual animation, so if you see me poking, like my toes kind of go inside you, that's that's totally normal. <laughs> oh, this is not good. So it gives you the false sense of hope. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Bullshit, man. Bullshit, Tago, buddy. That is why he's uh, that that is why he's not the uh, top tier character. Yes. He's good. It's just he's very reliant on mix-ups. He's very much a lot like kind of like a, like a gambler's character. It'd be good at reads. Uh, the sweep, kind of the same as Shoto sweeps. Very quick, kind of slow on recovery, but very quick. Can punish a lot of things. Decent range. Good control tool. It is very nice and quick, but you're right. The recovery is, it takes a long time. But you know, that's just... Mother feature. Oh, you motherfucker. Anyways, yeah. Ooh, look at that. With the setups. Got him. Oh! YOLO! No. <laughs> <laughs> I take that mother beacher. Okay, please. Uh, okay, so back to I guess we'll do j jumping kind of attacks. Uh, they are all literally the same as Ryu. So whatever I said in the Ryu tutorial, pretty much the same thing there. Uh, the main difference is his jump medium kick is his cross up in this game. Has oh really? Feels like I have shorter range than normal, but yeah, I can't cross up your corner. But it's a good cross up. It's decent. You can combo after it. Oh, that stupid uppercut! I'll cover that in a second. <laughs> but yeah, neutral jumps—they're whatever. You're not gonna use them too often. I guess neutral roundhouse is decent anti-air, but situational. Uh, his jump jab is good against claw players. Takes out a long time, but for the most part, not that important. It is a it is good way for to irritate players. Oh yeah. And uh, there's a special trick you can do with the jump attacks. If you just stand still for a second. You want me to stand still? You can do that. Oh. Which is important, but I'll cover that when I get through. Woo! You have cool to teach me these. Yeah, of course. And you, you can combo. <laughs> <laughs> combo. He has dope bad. combos. He has really dope combos. Um, so that's as far as jumping goes. It's not all that special to cover. But special moves. That's when Ken kind of shines in terms of uh, what he can do here. Oh! How dare you! Anyways, I don't know what you're doing. So number one is a fireball. It's just a quarter forward circle. Quarter forward, quarter circle. circle forward. There's something wrong with punch. this fight stick. Wait, wrong with you? <laughs> it, it is Sanwa. I think that is the problem. I love Sanwa. It's an eight way. Oh, that's, that's why it feels weird. Yes, right? Ooh, eight way, gross. That that is what that is what I was. I was like, what the hell is? Oh, it? a good pull hyphenated. I forgot to cover that. Uh, Ken doesn't have Ryu's jump, medium punch, juggle. Makes him a little weaker. Oh, the thing that goes the donk, the donk. It does like a million that. damage. He jumps, pop, pop, pop. Super. Yeah, it's bullshit. Then you can do two or three of them. He doesn't have that. So Ken doesn't have that. But he has other things to make up for it, especially this uh, jump jab, tattoo thingy. Uh, yeah. Anyway, what, did, special what did the other special move? Fireball. Travels at a different speed than Ryu's. Has more startup. Has more recovery. Definitely on paper not as good. But because it travels so slowly, it's actually kind of good in the, in the zoning game. Because if you're at a full screen, you recover kind of faster. And look, it makes it a little harder to jump. Also, his fireball, weirdly enough, kind of goes invisible halfway in through. Yes, he does. It makes it slightly hard to react to, so poor Honda players like Tanya here hate dealing with Ken's fireball. 
YOLO! Oh! Whatever, man. <laughs> Cheating ass whore. <laughs> Bullshit, I don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> oh, zero one, you just have air throw. Can you jump at me? Jump. What? Jump at me. Oh. Oh, shoot! Jump at me. He has air throw. Of course um, he has air throw. Come on, man. Not really a big deal. Not really a big deal. Like, you'll get out of accident most <laughs> of the time. Oh, fuck uh, you. So anyways, that. anyways, back to special moves. He has the uppercut. It's done with the forward. Down, down, forward. Punch. Unlike newer Street Fighter games, there's no shortcut for this. You just gotta learn it. Oh. Yes, so you, yeah, you I, can't I, do things like down, forward, down, forward, punch. You can't mash your stick on the bottom. You get punched. You gotta learn the motion. Man, I, I really... I, I have lots of problems with doing this on, 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 on this 8-way. Eh, it's alright. Feels a little weird, but for the most part. No, look at I'm I'm really trying. I comboed finally. Fuck you. Anyways, <laughs> no, seriously, I had so much trouble doing the Shryuken on this. I know, man. Well, it, eight way is a little weird to get used to. Yes, that is why I like my zippies. I know. So the crappy, hard. the crappy zippies. They're not crappy. They work perfectly well. <laughs> nice. So, anyways, uppercuts. Uh, definitely the jab one is the one you're gonna be using 99% of the time. It's fast. Recovers quickly. If you guys have ever played online, you know, doing two random uppercuts in a row can work. It often catches people off guard because they're not ready to punish it, so you do another one, just YOLO, YOLO. Look at that! Oh, he's, like, he's too scared to hit buttons! <laughs> but yeah, the jab was the best version. Uh, the fierce one looks pretty good, has good range. Really good against guys jumping from far away, especially claw players. Um, pretty much when you fight claw, you see him go to the wall, you do an instant fierce uppercut. When you, it doesn't do a lot of damage. Do you, ha you go forward what? and then down, down forward and down and then forward, or or can you no. just go down forward? Just forward, down, down forward. Oh, you don't have to go straight forward. No, never. I mean, you can. It's like kind of like the cheating way to do it if you don't know how to do it right. Oh, but that's it. Um, but yes, yeah, medium punch fireballs. Oh, sorry, uppercut. It's okay, but I don't find much use for it. Mostly it's a jab uppercut you'll be using a lot and the fierce one. But the problem is, is that if you do it kind of on wake up, like you get knocked down, your opponent attacks you on the ground, and you do the wrong uppercut, they don't always knock him, knock your opponent down. I don't know how it works. Maybe Cigar, Cigar Bob can enlighten us. I see him in chat. But sometimes they don't do all the hits, so actually, even though you hit him with the uppercut, they can still punish you. Because oh. <laughs> they didn't get knocked down. It kind of sucks. Uh, but yeah, it's one of Ken's weakness. Uh, what else he has? Uh, it's a spin kick over here. Done with a backwards fireball motion and kicks. Of course, different kicks do uh, different versions of distances. Uh, not too useful. There's a few setups where he can use it to kind of set up kind of tricky cross-under motions. Uh, but for the most part, you'll be using this too much. You might use it against like a Dalsam player going through fireballs from the last hit. But for the most part, you don't use it too much in the normal, except for that the neutral except game. for that combo thing. Not even a combo because there's better options for the combo. You can end the uppercut does more damage and knocks him down for free. Fair enough. But where it is useful is kind of in the air uh, with a certain advanced technique that I'll cover later on. If I can do it on this rear stick, but I will try anyways. Why you talk shit about this stick, man? Cigar Bob, you don't use it much against Sim. Yeah, you don't use it much. The only time I've seen Ken use it against Sim is like. If I'm on my last hit and I'm bleeding and I throw a fireball, they're going to do a spin kick, hit me once, and kill me. Other than that, there's not real much use for it. Uh, most of his air tattoos, oh sorry, his air tattoos are the ones that have a lot of use. If you can time it correctly, which is rather difficult, which adds to kind of Ken's execution issue. Oh yeah, so go ball, you make a good point, forgot about that. Against fat characters, Ken has a kind of touch of death cross up combo. That Yo, kills that's people. racist. How it is for, for fat people, dolls them and such. Uh, but yeah, outside of combos, you're not gonna see Tatsu very often. To be honest. Uh, what other specialties have? Oh, the crazy kicks. That's right. Crazy uh, kick. So, yeah, crazy kicks. Uh, so he has three what we called crazy kick motions. Um, the first one is fireball and kick. Doesn't matter which version you use, but they're all kind of the same. Roundhouse, light kick, fireball and kick. What, what do you mean? You do a fireball kick down. Oh, oh, you're you're talking about his uh, yeah. And 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 if you hold the button down, it goes slow. Yeah, you hold the button. That's for all the other things. Ooh. So yeah, you do crazy kick. Not really all that useful. Um, 
Good in combos, obviously. Uh, the best part is that usually you can do it, you can cancel off a low poke. So if you do uh, like a sweep that, you stay close, you can do pressure. As far as the neutral game, I haven't found a really effective. Oh, sorry. Oh, wait, my buttons. Oh, here we go. Okay, we're back. I was mashing buttons. It doesn't <laughs> work for Ken, apparently, mashing buttons. But yeah, as far as the neutral game, and uh, I don't see much use for it if there is one for that version of the crazy kick. It's not my color. You have a color for Ken. <laughs> you I have, have a color. color I'm for a serious Ken, Ken player, please. <laughs> <laughs> so okay. The other crazy kick is the half circle forward one. The oh, half circle? Thingy. Yeah. Has quite a bit of startup. But, uh, I didn't know this existed. Yeah. What, what is the difference? Most guys do it on accident. This one has a bit of startup, but it has a little more extended range and it makes you fly kind of full screen. Kind of cool for like counter pokes. I'm not sure if there's an actual practical use for it in terms of the neutral game. You might use it against like a Blanca, maybe a Dictator, maybe a Dalsum, kind of fish for a high poke. It works with, with all the kicks? Yeah, they're all the same version. Doesn't matter. There's like no difference in startup, recovery, whatever. But but it's, it takes longer to execute. Well, yeah, obviously. It's good in some combos, like if you go for immediate crouch forward, so if you stand still, stand still for a second. Oh, sorry, yes. You can do things like... Sorry. Uh. It's a two-hit combo makes you fly across the screen. Looks cool. It's a good kind of meaty low attack combo. If you like you to want. make people throw a fly across the screen, then good for you, man. Yeah, there it goes. And uh, the other one is the one no one likes. Because it just cocks block people. <laughs> it's an uppercut motion with kick. Oh! Ooh. Where is it? Ooh! Oh, no, sorry. It's not, sorry. I messed up. It's actually the weird reverse fireball motion. So you go from forward to down, forward to down, and do a uh, kick. Forward to down, forward to down? Oh. Really? Oh my god! Yeah, forward to down. Ah! Wait. This. This one, yes. Yeah, it sucks. It's Shit. terrible. I'm pretty sure it exists only to cock block you from doing like walk of sweeps. Oh, but the, the, this one right there, I was trying to do it, but you fucked me yeah, up. Yeah, it's weird like high kick, has a very short range. If there's a use for it, I have never seen down. it. Yeah, it's forward down, I messed up. Yes, it's, it's so green style. Oh, it just makes you go forward a little bit. It's kind of it's like a. It just has no range, it has no purpose. Silence like, go, you stop hitting back! Every time I've seen it, it just messes people up. Ooh. And like in terms of combos, there's a better combo option. It just messes people up, <laughs> as far as I can tell. If there's a use, y'all can do it. You can show me later then. Yeah, it's the green hand motion. It's that weird forward, down, forward, down motion that pretty much no one uses anymore, so. It seems to be very good at uh, dizzying. Huh? It seems to be good at dizzying people. Yeah, but there's other pokes. <laughs> That's good for it. It's a weird it's motion. Good Unlike CVS2, it's a useless. It's a good move. fake out move. Oops. But yeah, that's how it is. Oh, speaking of which, hold on. The terrible news. Anyways, and then for all his crazy kicks, he can actually do the motion and hold the kick down. He'll do the overhead. So you just do this. It's a good overhead. It's good on wake up if they're not seeing it coming. They're like, oh, I'm just going to hold down forward and whatever. Chill. And then boom, overhead. And it works for all the crazy kicks. So you do any crazy uh. kick and hold it. Yes. And he'll do the he'll kick and then just slice down. Over it. It's quite nice. I like. It works in certain combos. Like, uh, I think Cigar Bob mentioned in chat, there's a uh, fat character specific combo. So you do things like against. Fe oh, it was a Fei Long? I think Zangief works too. Yes. You can do a cross up, crouching medium punch, crazy kick, overhead, and link into sweep. And it pretty much stuns 100% of the time. I've never seen it not stun. But it's kind of cool looking. And uh, that's really about it. I want you to show moves. me the. I want you to show me the thing where where I go, where I go like this and then a tatsu. Oh, okay. Well, so Ken has this thing where he can cancel jump attacks into a spin kick. Yes. Which not only looks cool but actually pretty practical as well. But how do you do it? Especially against characters who don't have a good reversal against yes. the jump ins. Yes. So all you do is you jump and you hit. A, I do it with jab or fierce depending on what I'm doing, and then you hit it and then cancel into a into a into a spin kick. You have to do something. all of that really quickly. Yeah. Oops, sorry. Ah! There we go. This is crazy. Yeah. And you can combo afterwards if you hit him. Huh. If they block, you can walk up throw. If not, you can walk up uppercut. There's a lot of cool mix-up options. 
does chip damage, builds you meter. Kind of cool. So punch and then kick, basically. Just... Like you, 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 you jump in the air, you do the motion. Just... I don't know if you can do it now. Of course I can. Yes, I did it. There just it so is. I believe in you, buddy. <laughs> Yes, like Cigar Bob mentions in chat, is very, very good against Dawson. Awesome. That jump, or jump Tatsu, or jab Tatsu, first Tatsu. I like very, it. Very, very good. good. And if Sergievsky can do it, any spineless monkey can. Yeah, it's not too hard to learn once you do it. Not too difficult. You just jump and kind of with good timing, kind of do a jump Tatsu, and kind of buffer the motion while you press the button. Yes, yes, buffer Pretty the simple. motion. Now, if I can do all these sticks. Oh, come on. Ah, shoot, 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 shoot. There you go, juice kick. Oh, <laughs> your ass! <laughs> anyway, so there's so a technique. So move on, move on. There's a technique where you can jump in the air, instantly do a tatsu. Yes. And uh, Ken will do an air tatsu really low off the ground. And the trajectory is such that it kind of travels like a perfect kind of half circle shape really, really quickly. So it's really good for covering ground. Ooh. Okay. Do it. So it's do good it. for like. Do it, do it, do it now. Sticks. Man. Come on, you got this. Oh, God. No, that's not it. Don't worry, he will get it eventually. May take a couple of minutes, but you'll get it. If I can get it. Oh, come on! There it is, that's one. Oh, backwards. Why can't you do a forward? Oh. Why don't you come over to the other side? Here. No. There's backwards. So it's Why basically a jumpy forward. There's forward ones, huh? There's another one. Yeah, it kind of jumps forward, but it moves really, really quickly. So it can kind of catch people uh, by surprise. Oh, not, not the slow one. That's useless. You don't want to do that one. Um, I guess like tall characters like Saget, it's kind of a good surprise tactic. And if they're caught off guard, they'll block high. Uh -huh. and it'll actually make it'll actually connect with Saget, make him block, and then you can go for I don't know uppercut, throw mix-ups. Shit. It's good against Dalzim because uh, Dalzim tends to beat Ken really badly. But if Ken can kind of surprise Sim with a juice kick, get in, and destroy Sim off. You know, one. one well, it juice doesn't kick matter because I can't do it. So let's just forget about it. <laughs> So yeah, uh, the last thing we gotta cover, I guess, is the super. Oh, the super! It's done by doing two fireball motions into punch. You can sort of double uppercut. Uh, yes. The important thing about it is that you cannot reversal with that move. It's a glitch in the game. Him, Dalzim, and Saget have it, I believe. You can't yes. reversal super with that. So it's really only ever used in combos. Maybe as an anti-air, they use them to chip out your opponent if you're really close. Um, but let's see. Now let's see. To get ready for this, we can do this. You can combo into it doing two crouch shorts yes. into super. And it looks kind of hard and it seems kind of weird at first, but it's actually a pretty easy link, which surprised me because it looks like a You fast can do link. it. I believe in you. We all believe in you. So, what you do is you crouch, yes. you do short, short, and then you do the super motion. But when you do it, um, you press kick and punch at the same time. So, I do light kick and light punch at the same time. Okay. So, you do short, short, double fireball, like that. Short, short. Cigar Bob, you are short, short, severely <laughs> un overestimating my execution. I can't do that on the best of days. No, no, no. He, he, don't worry. He will do this. Even if it, it will take him like two hours. Especially not on this stick. I did a fight last night at the arcade. But we can we we can switch over to the superior zippy. I can't even like hit fierce on that thing. Please. without fucking up. That thing is terrible. I don't know how no, you play not. on that thing. I've looped these up with the olive really oil, good. man. Dude, your right click eventually stops working for like five seconds and then it hops in. No, 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 no. It works fine now. It works fine. That's not my color. Well, I'll try to do it. That's not my color. It's exactly X Gamer. I'm a Dalsum player. Can Why do you think I play Dalsum? I don't have good execution, but I can't. Even I can't fuck up back jab. For God's sake. Okay, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, 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 do it. Oh, do oh, it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Happy. You got the luck. Yeah, happy. You got that combo. Lucky. Yes, a combo. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, um, you have to do you have to do the super motion with a kick and light punch because of a of a system in Street Fighter 2 where you can't technically chain a super or special after a chain attack. It's actually built into the game where you can't do that. So you can't do like alpha s type combo where you do like short 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 fireball. The game Fine. just will not let you combo that. Even though the frame data might let you do so, it just won't let you do that. It'll like stop your move from canceling into a fireball. But you do a thing where you, if you cancel a stand short into a super, it'll do uh -huh. it. Because you kind of bypass that, that mechanic altogether. It's kind of a cool little, I guess, abuse of the system. Wait, 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 hold on. It's I was going to do it, and then the timer! Hard. It's just, I would have done it, but the timer went out. You know, I really had it right it's there. It's actually very slow. It looks like a fast sling, but it's just short, short, boom. It's just... 
quite laggy. It's weird. Anyways. So it, is, it. Uh, it is FBA. I can't do... Taka or whatever. Dr. Taka, whatever your name is. Yeah, it's it's a lot easier than it seems. Yeah, ta Taka, it's not a link. It's not like a third strike type thing. The motion is kind of the same, but you have to press uh, light punch and light kick at the same time. It's much easier than people think it is. It's just you gotta get used to the timing. Because it's not like a third strike, like, short, short, super. It's like a short, short, wait, and then you hit the buttons. Like, the timing is such where it feels like it should not work at the timing where you gotta press the uh, the light punch and light kick together. But oh, you have it to do it together. It works. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> You're not doing it, buddy, anytime soon. <laughs> so, those are pretty much the basic matchup details. I guess we can cover Take basic that. matchups if you want. Yes, of course, basic matchups. And whatever these guys want. So, I'm down for that. Nabil Robinson, I'm like not even gonna do touch of death. I can do the Matsun combo, which I learned this year at Evo. Mr. Bob. I call it the Matsun what combo. That's what he does, man. Yeah, Cigar Bob. Jesus is what I think in my head every time I come here. I'm just like, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Ken does not have any mashing moves. That is why I do not play him. Yes, he's a, he's a character of supreme skill and like thought. I, I you know can what I'm mesh, saying? I can mesh jab. Nami, what? I can mesh jab, see? Yeah. That's like it? Fuck, I can't even do that fast anymore. So anyways, so here's a massive combo special for you guys. So okay, you do, do it. Crouch short, stand short, crouch short, uh, crazy kick. The uh, fireball one, the okay. regular one. Let's do this. Only works on crouching, but well, simple for hit. Okay, for hit combo. Fairly yes. easy to do. The timing's not what you think it'd be. Yes. It's like short, short, wait, crouch, short thing. It's kind of a weird. Short, short, wait, crouch, short, ding. It's just boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. It's not like a CVS2 alpha combo, it's just. <laughs> you have takes to, a little bit of You have to have pause, patience. A little pause. Oh, so I'm not even going to try it. Cigar Bob, trust me, I cannot do combos. I wish I could. You're doing them right now, baby. Well, it's why Come I on. play Ken, so I can learn combos. I'm a Dalsum player. My combo is a two-hit combo or a super. That's, that's really the only combo you'll ever see in a Dalsum. My combo is the uh, is 100 hand slap. Your combo is just yes. playing the bongos on punches and see what happens. It works great, actually, see? Okay. Oh, okay. that shit. All right, our Cigar Bob. For you, good luck, everybody. Fuck! I messed up the link! I'm so dumb! Do it from the left side, you're better. God damn it! Oh, I did it too slow, didn't I? <sighs> Copy with me. Oh, there you go. Space it out a little bit. So there's a yeah. kind of a weird okie doke setup where you do this combo. Oh, fuck my life! Well, no, it's okay, you did two two hit combos. I hate my life! Anyways, the idea <laughs> is that <laughs> you do that combo, you do a half circle forward crazy kick, and you'll actually go on the other side of your opponent, which catches most new players off guard. And then from there, you do stand fierce uppercut. And that's guaranteed stun on pretty much everyone. It's kind of a trick play. It only works maybe once or twice. But once a player knows it and knows what it looks like, it should never work ever again. But then you can do mix-ups like you do spin kick, and then just instead of doing that stupid kick, you do like a crouch short into an uppercut or super. Beautiful. I wish I had better execution. It's okay. Don't blame yourself. Blame the stick. Oh, I can't do short, short uppercut. It's Guys, cool. do you know how to do short, short uppercut? I know it's like the super motion, but it never seems to work for me. I don't know. If short, short thing. uppercut. Yeah, you can combo crouching short, short uppercut. Uh huh. It's theoretically the same motion as doing the uh, short, short super cancel. I just can never get it out played. But I don't really practice <laughs> training most of it anymore. Same timing too? Hold on. Let me try this. Let me try this. Shoo! 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 I'm, I'm playing here! Okay. Hey, there you go! Did a combo though. Hey, you did three hit combo. I still didn't combo. Oh, no. You do it too slow. But I just messed up. But, yeah. Forward, down, down, forward, low punch, yeah, low kick. Taco, I have trouble execution. I can do that just fine. I can't do the uppercut version. I don't fucking know. Four okay. down, down. F you know it in theory. That's all that matters. Anyway, so that's a basic Ken tutorial. Okay. Again, basic. If you want like higher level, intermediate, advanced level stuff, do not watch me. That's <laughs> that's for YouTube to do. Look at videos of really good Ken players. Cigar Bob's up there. He can do some stuff. I think Cigar Girl can do play some Ken stuff too as well. Oh yeah, Cigar Girl. She plays the mean Ken. Yeah. Um. Yes. Obviously, really good Japanese Ken players like Matsun. Anakin. I, I guess think Chosu, Miller, Miller time needs like to get him. up here to do some uh, to some do, do I some think character. So. Let me uh, out for me, Tanya. Tanya, want to help out? 
Yes. No? Okay. What? <laughs> Screw you. Keep being weird. Anyways, so we'll, do, we'll show some basic matchups just to see what it feels like. So here's Ken Honda. Very much the same thing as fighting Ryu versus Honda. Shit. Very basic. You just want to zone out Honda, punish his dumb mistakes like that. He'll jump, sweep. Oh, shit. Uppercut. Yeah. Fucking bullshit. <laughs> I hate uppercuts. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking bullshit. You suck. This control, there's some, this controller is broken. I'm telling you guys, there's something wrong with my controller. Now the danger of this match is when Honda gets close. Yes. Because he can do a world of pain off of Ocho mix-ups. Yes. I know the Ocho mix-up, it's, it's delicious. Oh no! Like I'm dying. I had an Ocho right there, but uh, there was something wrong you, with my controller, so it didn't work. So if Honda can get close, which is difficult for Honda, admittedly, uh, it's bad. It's very tough. Sweep. Yep. Good old standard show to play. What? Oh, she go for it. Who, who are you calling a she? Mother <laughs> bitch! <laughs> you piece of shit, I hate you! <laughs> I didn't know I was going to go cross upside on you, actually, on that one. You were trying to go Honda. That was interesting. I didn't Kay. know it goes past him. For a fat character, that's surprising. Okay, this is something uh, wrong yeah, with this controller. Yeah, but pretty basic fighting Honda. You just want to zone him out, throw a fireball, so right, he does, you, you don't counter. even need to do a Ryu, do you? Do a Ryu, yeah. Okay. It's got a matchup. I'm, I'm really going to get him this time. I'm going to try my hardest here. So that's how you fight Honda. If he gets close, it kind of helps to sort of chill out, block, let him push himself out. Uh, if he goes for very aggressive play, you can uppercut his hands if you really want. Ah. Oh. God damn it. I'm trying to do this shit here. I'm trying to do my thing. No, Come no, on! No one ever punches that. Well, I no. didn't. I didn't know that you were uh, that you were on the other side. Please. <laughs> so basic strategy. Uh, this is definitely Ryu favored. So I should win right now. Oh no! Yeah, he's a better fireball, better zoning game. But Ken has better mix-ups. God, you don't stop hitting buttons, do you? Oh, you what? Do this. Oh, I'm that's what bad. you get. That's what you get. How you like this, eh? I'll, I'll bring it back. Hold on. Oh, I, I sorry. Sorry, Red. Why you basically wins with a red fireball? What? Shit, that was. That Go was next time. Ups. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you and your bullshit game. This bullshit. So yeah, the main way Ken wins is either on the footsies on the ground, if you can get around his red fireball, it's kind of even there. Uh, obviously, if Ryu jumps, go for the uppercut, nice and simple. But Ken's mix-ups are really annoying. Jump medium punch. The basic okay. mix-ups are like, get close and go for uppercut, go for low, go for throw. Oh, you're just going to... Uh this guy never stops hitting buttons! <laughs> YOLO! Fuck you. What? Fuck you. <laughs> Why don't you fun. talk about what you're That's doing fun. here instead? This match is actually pretty hard. Uh, Ken no. can pretty... Oh, sorry. Chung Lee, her crouch medium kick gives Ken a lot of trouble. Crouch medium kick? Yeah. That, that oh. If you whiff it right here, right there. Ah. Right here. Whiff, whiff, right there. Yeah. That I can't do anything about. Oh, really? I can't do anything about it. This is good to know. I can trade Crouch with it, but it won't be imme immediately in my favor. Uh huh. Her stand medium kick stops my fireball, so she can just pretty much walk around, do that. That trade for me. No. That's rough. Oh, no. Oh. Yes, yes, you suck! You <laughs> suck! I win! <laughs> Please, I'll be here all night. Thank you. Yeah, it's all about matchup. Alright. Well, uh, Pretty much let's, mix up let's restart character. this so that... Uh, Why? So that we don't have to do this again. Ooh. I don't want to keep beating you, you know? Oh, mix-ups. 
Oh, you threw me. It's oh! Time. Oh, I missed my opera card, you piece of shit, AK. Shit. Oh! Hate you. Oh, I hate you. I need to learn how to do the super. <laughs> Hers? Yes. Here's on this. Really? With kick instead, but yeah. Oh! I will do this now. Hey, hey! Yeah, this is rough. You, you pretty much have to outplay Chun Li in the mix-up game. Get close. Yeah, the matchup she can wins. Delicious! <laughs> but yes, in terms of matchups, I mean, you guys are talking about it in chat right now. He doesn't win much of it. Uh, old Psychic destroys him with basic zoning. Dalsum is kind of the same thing. The only saving grace that Dalsum. Uh, he gets wrecked off a of mix up from Ken. Ooh! Whatever. So you Which so matchup does he win? Ken wins against New Ken. Who does he win against? Uh, Zangief. What are some? Hey guys, no, throw me some Zangief, Zangief moves. Him. Zangief destroys him. Oh, shit. Shit. Yeah, this match is all zoning. How do you do the green hand? Oh, what the hell? Ah, oh, shit. How do you do his throw moves? Oh, yes. Yeah. Wow, Cigar Bob, you think it's close to even? How That's do you a rare opinion. I thought Geef totally, or uh, he won that. No, Interesting. Geef is close? 6 4 Geef, okay, that sounds right. You're, you're a Ford broken, by the way. What? A Ford. It's broken? Yeah, look. <laughs> well, that explains the juice kick situation. Like, why can't I jump? Huh. Yes, it works and then it doesn't. Uh, it's either a gate or wiring issue. But yeah. Most likely. We will have a. Uh, quality we quality will, parts here, Arcadium. Later. Don't worry about it. What? Oh, there it is. <laughs> You got it, man. How dare you throw me! Dang it! You're no fun. <laughs> how, do, how do you how do you do his special moves? Zangief? Yes. It's different tutorial, but uh. Ah, so whatever. I don't punch, have time for that. All three punches, all three kicks. The grab is a 360 motion, so good luck with that. Not very easy to do. Like oh, that? Fireball's gone. Yeah, the kick one, anyways. Like these? Yeah. Hard to do on the ground without some training, but if I can learn how to do 360, any anyone can do it. Oh! Where do you start with a 360? Yolo! How what? do you? Where does this 360 start? Anywhere, but I do it from front, half circle back to up. Oh, I see. Okay. All right, moving on. I don't know about these sticks. <laughs> Please. But yeah, that match is pretty basic. You want to keep Zangief away as far as, as as much as you can. You definitely don't want. Do you want? Do you want to uh, uh, switch sticks to the zippies? Yeah, I'm good. Cool. This match is all footsies. I actually like this match a lot. Your fireball isn't as abusable as a uh, Ryu's here. Rare Fireball doesn't do a knockdown. He can't slide underneath that, but... Oh, I, oh, I, I, I can't? No. I far just sure, but... Oh, my Ford's out. Ah, oh, good. Oh, it's back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm uppercutted. Place. Classic online mix-up. Uppercut, uppercut, uppercut. I love it. Oh, it's because this is on emulator mode? Oh, my Ford's out. Oh, here it is. Back. 
That's a weird match here. Uh, the shuttle's crouch punch still works very well here. It's one of the banes of Blanca's existence. Stuff's that <laughs> roundhouse clean. And stuff uh, slide clean too. Pretty safe to throw out there. If he jumps, he can uppercut on reaction. If Blanca ever jumps. Uppercut. Oh, I fucked up! Oh, I remember this! No! Oh, in my ass! <laughs> It's his. Oh, is it? Is it, 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 it? Well, what? never mind. What? What? Tell me. I'm. I am now talking about the other characters, but this is the can tutorial, so you need. To <laughs> hey man, it's not an Arcadian tutorial without some tangents along the this way. This is true. Guy, oh man, that was tough too. How zoning I like Kyle. really hurts Ken. A lot of backfists get eaten on this matchup. How do but you do? If he gets knocked down. How do you do up, his Single claw. You blocked that. I'm impressed. Oh yes, I, I can do this now. Ah! Awesome. Bullshit. <laughs> you know, I've, I've I've like played guy like once. In oh, life. I know, I know. If you knew what you're doing, the zoning, you can back this that, by the way. But yeah, Gal's Sonic Boom has really fast recovery. He has a lot of good options in case you do jump. Mother bitcher, I hate this guy. Dirty. I hate playing against him and I hate playing against him because I never played him. Okay, fine. Dirty, 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 Bullshit. dirty, dirty. Yes, please! Yeah, this game That's sucks! Good. Let's see, Nabil Robinson, what's the best motion to mash when you're getting knee bashed? Mike Ken versus... Isn't old Ken Um. Well, what I do when I get dizzy, when I get caught in a mash, it doesn't seem to help too much against a mash, especially not Ken's mash, but I, I mash... Opposite diagonals, so for my hands, it's easier for me to go down, oh, that's down horrible. right to up back. Just mash that and all the punches. Seems to work against uh, Dizzy. Not against mash moves. And this is why I can, can kill Dalsum. Yeah. He's bullshit. <laughs> the safe jump, too. Bullshit. You can't stop that jump. After that uh, the knee bash, my jump, yes. you can't do anything about it. He's dead. How do I do stuff with this guy? Woo! How do I do stuff with this guy? I make it look easy, yeah. don't I? I make it look easy. You make it look easy because <laughs> you're playing against me, you mother beacher. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I haven't mashed out of a lot of mash attacks. I've done it out of Blanca's. For some reason, Blanca's throws. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't. If you mash it, early enough, it. you can even like bounce out without it. getting hit once. It's weird, but for Ken, it doesn't seem to work very well. Random, I'm not random. used to playing a pink dick. Pink dicks? It's a random ration. I guess ratio or variation. So what is happening uh, here right now? Oh. Uh, why is uh, why is this a good or bad matchup for Ken? This? Because yes. Bad no matchup reversal. for Ken. I mean, it's good when Ken gets an e-bash and he gets in and safe yes. jumps and all that stuff, but. I don't know, Dictator has a pretty easy time trading with his fireballs. Now the seven knee bashes. What is this talk about these seven knee bashes that the GMC Zero says this bullshit nothing, eh? Oh wait, seven percent chance to get the hyper throw, seven seven different knee bashes. Oh, there are seven different oh, knee the... bashes. Cigar Bob, are you sure you're not saying uh that there are seven different elbows in Krav Maga, because that I know. I learned all of them. Very useful in uh, the field of defense. I hate oh, this good thing. to know, Sir Bomb. I did not know that. Yes, I, I, I realize the, uh, the octagonal uh, gate is a little bit uh, interesting to play on. Oh, oh yes! Attack. That is right. Each different level of knee bash has a 
Deke. Oh, fuck. Stop! But how can there be seven? <laughs> there are seven different levels. You have you have six buttons, which is the sev number seven. I don't get it. Well, as in you do an e bash, and you have a certain percent chance to do different levels of knee bash. Knee bash seems pretty self-explanatory. It seems like mashing as a Ken player gives you a little more hits. I don't know if that's true or not. Like maybe a placebo effect or whatever it is, but I hate you. How dare you? Oh, I I understand now. I thought you were talking about like use usage of different buttons to execute the, the Jnibish. You're just saying that is this random? Now that Tony kind of knows what to do better against it better. His block goes out a couple times. Yep. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. It is. Uh, it is not uh, the stick. It is the. Uh, it is you guys. Oh, you mother! Oh, you messed up my shit! I hate that cross medium kick. God damn it! I hate that cross medium kick. Ken's really fun, but man, he has some bad matchups. That's rough. You can do this, El Presidente. You oh, what? You need to beat Chun so that uh, we can move on to I the hate next. Hate you? Only Ellen R. Oh! Oh my god. Mash for the win. These you, you can have her, it will go in time with the stick motion. Interesting. Good to know, Sir Garbob. Is all that listening to the wiki, Sir Garbob? Out of curiosity. First time I've heard of this percentage nonsense. It was 7%. Trouble has to uh, to make sure that he loses a certain percentage of matches against Miller Time. Oh, you mother! To keep the peace, you know. It's in your head. Oh, that's why no one's heard of it. Oops. There we go. She's super. Oh, no. I didn't have super. Me, not you, dork. It's enough. To, yeah. Oddly enough, like a lot of the ST information is not really in the wiki, as far as I know. Why is it not? Why is it not added? Oh, a lot of guys just didn't bother authoring it. This is atrocious. Really? The leaks thought you had it? Fucking Carl, why doesn't your stick work? That is not my stick. You oh, you ate my input! <laughs> oh. <laughs> It's a tradition, Tanya. All Arcadian sticks must be a little broken. A little bit. Not too much to be like unplayable, but enough to be like kind of fun around. You know, if they are if they are too reliable, then people will begin to expect this on a regular basis. You know what I mean? Yeah, true. So, oh, uh, by adding a little bit of flaw here and there, you know, it's kind of like the difference between uh, offline play and online play. You know? When this you learn... This girl just likes to do whatever she wants. It's nice. Chun? Yeah, it's very liberating. <laughs> it's like... I have to play these dodge the fireball game. Yeah. I can just get in that ass if I feel like it. Well, she has to dodge some fireballs, but <laughs> for the most part, she has a super to do that for her. If you get lazy, really, really lazy. Okay, you, you need to lose Miller time so that uh, you can move on to the next character matchup. Yes, there we go. Yes. Damn, Miller time. What are you doing? You, you used to be good. Damn. In your own show! <laughs> I thought she was just pointing at me. <laughs> With uh, the specific fingers. Yes, what is this, uh, what is this middle finger everyone keeps pointing at me? What does it mean? I thought it was more like, you know, like, I hey, you. you know, hey, you over there, you over there, you know? 
I did not. Yeah, know. you. <laughs> yes, hey, you yeah, over yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Come here. What are you guys doing here? You can also go like this, you know. Come here. Come here. Okay, I'll trouble. You need to finish this, man. So what if you will sleep on the couch for the next week or two? Huh? Why are you sitting there, Shrek? Oh! There we go. Yes, yes. Use your super. There we go. Ah! Oh shit! Yeah! Oh! <laughs> I can't the fireball. Oh, crap. Oh, man, that was fun. Yes, you would have never heard the end now, of Billy it. Billy Robinson, uh, who is the best charged fireball character? Chun Li or DJ? Definitely not Guile, Jesus Christ. DJ? Guile saw it like a maybe mid tier, high mid tier, but he's not up there. It's definitely I, Chun or DJ. I vote for Chun. DJ. DJ's good, he's gotten better. Okay, can I use kick without my, without my jump? Oh! Oh, I know. Oh no, you uh, you lose your place. future. Oh fuck this game. Ah, breakfast? No. Oh, bad I tell you. That's a bad idea. That was a good idea. Let's do it. Yolo. Let's do it. Yolo. Zero. You but say Chun? Why are you say Chun instead of DJ? This should be a lot harder than it is. Yeah, it's very nice throw. Oh, it's hard to jump. Oh, my medicine combo! So the general, uh, the general meat nope. and potatoes oh, of uh, of Guile is after every move you do, you just you Sonic, uh, you, you Sonic Boom, yes. It's always have ch Sonic Boom charge, yes. <coughs> what now? <laughs> Very nice. Oh! Ooh, yes, sir. Hello, hello. It's pink Guile. He's amazing. It's not pink. Hot boom. Jump. Where's your jump? Breakfast? No. Ah, jumping is overrated. Oh! Oh no! Oh my jump! Oh, there it is. Okay, okay. I really like uh, Miller Times uh, Guile. It's aggressive, you know. She doesn't just back into a corner and then and you know do her bullshit. She's in the middle. She's she, she's controlling you, you know. Huh? <laughs> well, that's the guy way, really. Like that's. Well, I was just saying. Guile's usually, usually when I see you play Guile, you sit in the corner and you throw fireballs. That's all you do. That's control. No, that is bullshit. Miller time. Bullshit. Miller time. She's <laughs> she. I do. She has Jump. balls, you know. She play like men. Look at her, you know. That was a melee. That stayed fierce. Well, can I please get a fireball? There we go. Yes. Can there I we please go. get a fireball? <laughs> there we go. Oh, oh, look at this. Look at this. He's mashing. Ah, oh, come on, please. Wow. It's basic and boring, but I like stand fierce off the cut. It's just fun. Mr. Igloo, all this talk about my troll can show up pretty much when the tutorial's over. Jump. Got him. Oh. Oh no, so much whiffing, so much bullshit. God damn it. Come on, Miller Time, you got this. Whoop. Oh my god. Whoop. Whoop. <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> I was like, fuck it. Very nice. Can't die anyways. Oh shit. Oh. Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> oh, you could have come back from it, but fuck! <laughs> yes! Yeah. So, for those who don't know, if God likes to preempt the back fist, try to hit you out of your fireball, your stand jab and your stand medium punch will hit it clean. Clean! Clean! Crowd strong can too, but I like the stand strong version better. It looks a lot more stylish. It commits more. You know, it only beats the back fist. Oh, Miller Time, uh, you're not giving up, eh? Oh no. Up. There we go. Here we go. Play a few times on my side. Jump. Oh, wrong, oh, wrong jump, but I'll take it. So after uh, jump. after El Presidente and uh, the Miller time oh, has uh, finished this tutorial, uh, I believe we're going to uh, out. we're going to do a little bit of uh, got next uh, matchups. 
and uh, we're not going to just stick with Super Turbo. We're going to oh. do whatever game in Fight Kid you want. I for yeah, we'll one. We'll fuck around. We'll play ST, Twinkle Star Sprites. That's Twinkle Star game. Sprites, of course. I'm down for Alpha. Uh, magical, uh, m magical Drop Three. Uh, some Rainbow, Rainbow Edition, of course. Uh, Capcom Sports Arena, something, something games. Very good stuff. There's a bunch of mini games in there. Uh, there's so many different games. Breaker's Revenge, yes. Uh, oh, maybe some Vampire Savior. Uh, let's see and what the game called. The run to the Sergevsky's bathroom. What the fuck? You know game? Uh, I believe this was SNK game. Yes. Whoa, that was weird. Come on, you got this. What? So. Goku Fight Kid. I want to play Twinkle Star mm -hmm. Sprites. Mm -hmm. I will play Twinkle Star Sprites. I will beat you so hard in this game that you will cry for weeks. Oh, shit. You will just wake up randomly no, after a good night's up. rest. <laughs> and so you'll start crying. Finish. The idea is just to wake up. Uppercut. Can't go wrong. Wake yeah, what's Ken? Like Mr. Igloo says, my troll can? Too good. Ooh, a claw match, last one. We'll cover this one and we'll call whatever the next segment. Okay, this is good. So, uh. This matchup, Jesus hard. He's gonna use the last damn medium kick. Go the wall again. Dare you. Oh shit! Do it. I'll do it. Wall? Oh, what? Uh, Fuck wrong it. anti -air. Fuck it. Yeah, this match claw if she plays don't, properly. Don't Stan punch. medium kick fucks him up bad. But the uh, the advantage that Ken has is that his wildness can often uh, catch him off guard. Like that. And then keep doing this. Oh, you fuck! <laughs> So what's the difference between Old Ken and New Ken? Okay, so the Old Ken is a secret character in this game, but pretty much everyone who plays this game for reals knows the code is. Uh, the main difference is that Old Ken doesn't have pretty much a lot of his specials, like the crazy kicks. He has the Tatsus. He doesn't have the roundhouse, stand roundhouse. He doesn't have the overhead and that stuff. Hey! Hey! <laughs> I hate being charged characters in a tick throw. But that's how Ken wins that mix up. Uh, but Claw does technically win in a neutral game, but again, if that Claw player isn't on point, we can do this all day long. Fuck. And then this, oh, what's my uppercut? Would it work too? Go to the wall. Dare you. Dare you go to the wall. Go. YOLO! And you do that. What? Damn, that's a nice Claw throw, actually. Oh, it's too low. I hate that dumb stand medium kick. I play with skill integrity. That's how you do me? Okay, I got you. I got you. I got you. Mr. Eagle, you don't want none? Once my Ken's warmed up, I'll fight you in the mirror match again. You had me yesterday. I'll, I'll give you that. You had a good night. Fuck combos. Oh, I did, didn't do the wall dive. God damn it. Chippy, 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 chips. So is that it? You want to start the uh, got next or challenge?